Hello everybody with new Pokemon Snap. We're going to Fireflow Volcano today where it's hot, hot, hot. That was super lame. I could have been at even lamer and been like hot, 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 just like me. <laughs> That's a lie. <laughs> but the reason why I'm starting here is uh honestly it was just cuter if, if i if i'm just gonna be honest with you it was just cuter is something happening why are the shanks running away oh all right bye peace out but uh in the description it said prehistoric times so i figured hey what's more what's more crazier than a new level uh prehistoric times so i i wanted to do here is there no more aerodactyl <gasps> oh god get that thing out of here i'll take that but i i guess huh you could hear some happy humming noises. Hi Charmander, bye Charmander. Um Okay. Definitely a lot more new things. So I, I got to keep my eye on the ball. But we did we did get Charmander. I'm gonna assume there's no Charmeleon because especially with the level up, no nobody likes him apparently. Okay. Oh, there's Aerodactyl. There's another one. You gotta hit that booty. Uh, I think this is... A oh, God. Yeah, no, this is definitely a new route. This is definitely a new route. I don't... Because... Okay. So, I, maybe we didn't have to kill all the Gravelers after all. Hi, Charmander. I see you over there. It's not that I don't like you. I mean, yeah, it's 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 literally blue. It's literally blue lava, something you don't see at every day. So, yeah. Yo, that was actually pretty baller. Back, she demon. Yeah, no, this is terrifying. Um, everybody run away. Like, I don't, I, there, I don't know. Oh, uh, well, that looks new. Oh, dude. Actually, Charmander is becoming extremely cute. Like, how I like the starters is it's probably Bulbasaur, Charmander, and Squirtle. Sorry, Blastoise. Is that mother flipping Typhlosion? What are you doing, bro? Typhlosion, you're 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 not bad. I'm sure we'll see him in a in a very future Pokemon game. Okay, bye. I 
deep exit extends beyond the ruins. Okay. Well, obviously we were gonna go here because it's the only way out apparently. And also, if we didn't know about this route, how? Why is the exit here? Okay, I just realized that. If we d if we never knew this place existed, how? How is there an exit? Don't give me that. Oh, it's a video game. Uh, logic here. Get out of here. It doesn't make sense. Okay, well, that is a new area. Uh, we got... Apparently, we've never gotten Aerodactyl before, which I think is malarkey. But... Shanks, very good picture. What if Graveler was just like... Hur! I don't even think Shanks should be in there, but I know Luxray was uh, in there. A lot of... Uh, there's not a lot of middle class... Well, actually, I, I'm i noticing there's a lot more middle class than I thought. Yeah, I'll take, I'll take the butt shot. Which Pokemon has the cutest butt? Let me know in the comments down below. Obviously. Typhlo- that's not a good picture, but I'll take it. I love how that's a two-star. So, we'll see. I mean that this has to be uh blue magma okay if by the way yeah if there's like a tag that you get it's almost certain that it was story based so that's very interesting there wasn't a new route but between level one and two uh an entrance was blocked so it's automatic which is which is very nice very nice. Hey, spoilers, Meganium Man that you can't see because I'm covering it. I can't believe there was ruins that deep inside. They must have been built be by people too, right? Right you are, and most likely some special purpose in mind. As for the big hole we saw on the wall, I picked up Illumina Pokemon energy coming from inside. Where do you suppose the hole leads, Uwu? I wouldn't be surprised if it was a tunnel all the way far off the volcano. What kind of Pokemon do you think? Well, we'll have to see for ourselves. Good luck. It's it's a Doug trio. It's a Doug. Uh, no no other Pokemon could reach that far. Obviously. Obviously. But yes, uh, a lot shorter episode. I'd have to say from the episode previously. I'm not even gonna cut that episode up. But uh, this is supposed to be the final Illumina Pokemon. And we'll we'll see. Yeah, yeah, it could another very spiritual Pokemon. I I approve of this. I'm very surprised. I'm very surprised. I oh no, there's two of them. Oh, I like that. <laughs> I like that. I approve. No, duh. Not even a please. Not even a please, though? Oh. That's one of the ancient ruins. Okay. Oh, let me... Let me throw... Let me throw some jazz at you. I I don't I don't know if I have to throw stuff at you or what. I sort of like both in frame. Oh, well, who knows? I maybe I can't hit you because I don't have turbo. People have mentioned turbo to me. I I I just don't know. Is this going to be the most confusing one? I mean... Why stop at four, by the way? Why stop at four Lumina Pokemon? Okay. Definitely, probably one of my favorite tracks so far. Come 
Come on now. Daddy needs a new pair of shoes. I wonder if you could fail this. I wonder. Like, if I don't get their shields down... This is the only one so far feeling like a boss battle. And I don't know how I feel about that. Like, you're not dropping your shields. And I, f I find it very funny that it may not even qualify as a picture. Like, it definitely looks like I'm lowering the shields. But I could just be dumb. Very interesting. Be like, no, that doesn't count as a picture. It has flames around it. But... See, the, Mega the Meganium was huge, by the way. These don't seem that huge to me. But then again, if a giant moth came out of nowhere, yeah, I'd be a, I'd be a little scared. I'd laugh so hard if I actually have to throw fluff fruit at him. Oh my god, I do. That is hilarious. You have to throw fluff fruit. Wow. That's a joke. Makes very little sense. Okay. Who knows? Could be scripted too. It's like, hey, where'd that go? He's like, I will eat your soul. Alright. I I approve. Because I, I know for a fact I got one picture. Yeah. Yeah, I, I think that is the only one that you could technically fail. Yeah, I know it said at the beginning of the level, you know, the orbs won't work. Uh, you know, try shooting the fire down. And I'm like, oh, all right. Well, the only other button that I have is apples. All right. I, I approve. I, I approve of this. I did it. You know, I it's funny to me that how shorter this uh, Let's Play could have been. But I'm glad that I enjoyed it. You know, I, I didn't... I It's not like I didn't enjoy it no matter what, so... It doesn't hurt that a series went a few extra episodes. But I'm sure you could have beaten this in maybe six hours. Cool. Alrighty. The final Lumina Pokemon. Yeah, we could have done way better on that. Okay. Banquet of Fire, Bug Collector. All right, so what's his last message? Uh, this could be the end of the game, as far as I know. You know, maybe it teleports us to the meteorite or something. But I'm going to assume there has to be at least one more world. Like, there has to be, in my opinion. So let's see. Come on. How come you're always the one who finds the Lumina Pokemon? I'm sure you'll have the pre pleasure before long, Phil. Anyway, by looking at things, the Tuller meteorite affected a wide area. Yeah, Professor, just like you thought, I wonder if the nearby Pokemon made it through. Okay. Judging by how far the effect spread, I would assume the impact caused the tremendous damage. 
but haven't found a shred of evidence to support that assumption. Do you think that the Lumina Pokemon we saw just now was the last ones? Good question, I actually just discovered something remarkable on that front. Let's discuss it when we're all back together. Okay. okay. I mean, what does it matter? Awesome. <laughs> Get ready. They were talking about a menage a trois, by the way. Oh boy. Yep. Okay. I had a feeling. Now then. What we have observed the Lumina Pokemon we encountered on the four islands, that they're all gorgeous for one thing. Every time we're in contact with, with one, we also detect energies at uh, different locations throughout the regions. That's a possibility, but there's more. So far, we picked up five energies reading from the final uh, funnel of the pinpoint, the location of the fifth. I suspect so, yes. Take a look here at our final and next island. Okay. That's like a million miles away. Wait a second. Doesn't that white mean snow? Yes, it's an area covered in it. Get ready, everybody. It's time to uh, explore an island that Captain Vince himself never reached. All right. Let's just make sure. Oh, I knew there, there had to be another cutscene. I've got some news I think you'll like. Since we're going new areas, I was given the Neo a special upgrade. Oh, there's the turbo, namely a turbo function. This is really get things moving. I got to take a spin in it just now. Trust me, the thing could move. Not only you could get where you're going faster, but you'll also have more controls over the timing of photos. As far as details, take it away, Rita. Do you turbo use the ZR function? The Neo could go faster as long as you hold that button. And speaking of changing of speed, did you know that Neo slowed down automatically when you look behind or zoom in on something? That's because it reacts to how you move your camera. Adding Turbo to mix things up, snap photos of Pokemon from lots of different angles. All right, cool. Well, I couldn't have gotten the Turbo any closer, but thank you everybody for watching this episode of New Pokemon Snap. I hope you truly did enjoy. And in the next episode, it is gonna be the final island and I hope to see you soon. This has been Joe Wild Plays. Uh, if you like what you saw and heard today, please do consider subscribing and I hope you're happy because you made me happy by watching. Take care and I'll see you all real soon. Bye bye.